raisins. Oh, where where they go? Turn the carb. All right, so I got those raisins because I love those Thompson raisins. I want another sample, but like they're gonna see me take it. <laughs> hey, though. Hey, I rats. think of um, Peppa Pig. It's oh, look here. Look at this. Quite festive. Salamander. The road. I don't want it to go on the road. Uh oh. Where'd he go? He's under your shoe. Oh. Is he trying to hide? I'm kind of. Trying to hide under my shoe and it's scaring me. Hey, got those barns. You got stuff and. Just rolling that top. Whoa. No, I wasn't gonna show them yet. Oh. <laughs> I can't do that yet. It has to be a surprise, Dad. Here's our family reality vlog for this weekend. Yeah, the weekend. I don't know if I need <clears throat> any more water. Oh. oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Even the handle's hot. Oh. It's so good. It's like two hours later and, and you're still in the kitchen. Oh boy. Dr. Oh. Mm. oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Even the handle's hot. Oh. You gotta be careful. You don't want to break your fingers off or get blood in the uh, mixture. I didn't take off that wrap. You get blood in the mixture, it's gonna look like somebody did something, tried to hide it. You know, like in the sausage factory when somebody's bad, and you wonder why the sausage has a little different flavor to it. Ew. Makes you wonder what's really in there. Is this dough consistency or no? Yeah, it's doughy, but it doesn't have any yeast in there, so you're not making any pretzels. It does seem right. Well, did you try it? Yeah, I guess it's right. I don't want them to be like really shaped. I need to fix Stand back from the stove, baby. Where's it going over here? What's happening here? Delicious. Smell like, it smells like something burning in here. Did it look burnt to you? No. I don't know, so I can't breathe. Oh my gosh, it's, see, it's dark out there. This is like one project. It seemed like it, it took, took longer than you anticipated, huh? It's like two hours later and, and you're still in the kitchen. Oh boy. Dr. Phil. Oh. Mm. oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. Even the handle. I can't believe how warm it is outside. It was pouring down. I know. Okay, that. I'm not gonna keep, I'm not lying to you. Okay, see what time it is right now? Yeah. I woke up at almost one. Hmm. On the weekend because I went to bed at like two. I was watching YouTube videos. But oh. I'm just like I was like sitting in my bed. And I, I woke up at like ten and yeah. then I sent my streaks to people and then went back to sleep. And then I had this weird dream that there was some like planet galaxy thing outside and then we heard this big boom and then like it started thunderstorming and then like the wind was so hard like the door wouldn't shut and we had to have like Brittany and I shut it. Like she couldn't shut it so I had to like go in front of her and like I don't know, something to shut it. And then I woke up and it was pouring down rain against my window and I was like, how the heck did that happen? Like I heard I heard thunder in my dream and then when I woke up there was thunder in real life. So like wow. I don't understand how that happened. Huh. How does that happen? Yeah. Well you heard it, so it became part of your dream. <clears throat> really? Yeah. That's so weird. Oh my god. My, yeah, I went to sleep with makeup on too. Don't do that. Hmm. That's not good. That's not healthy for your wow. skin. It's not healthy for your skin and or for your eyes because that's bad. <gasps> did you go to that place? Yes I did. Ooh. I absolutely <gasps> did. Dude. Got all kinds of yummy stuff in there. After all I ate last night, my stomach is smaller than it was last night. And I was like, what the Got some right? yummy stuff. Look at that. Oh. Look at how much small. Oh, look at how much smaller. Well, you can't really see it, but like, yeah. look how much smaller it is. Wow. It got a little bit smaller, and I was like, yo, lady. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah. Hold up. Hold look at that there. We'll see what happens. Are you freaking kidding me? <sighs> oh 
Who the freak did who would just do this stuff in here? <sighs> All right, um I'm just stressed right now. I, I just don't know who came in this house, done this, or this is some kind of prank Brianna pull. I mean, just like moving the couches around, making me think, oh, something, you know, crazy happened. I don't know, but I'm going to look at the outdoor, indoor surveillance and kind of rule it out. Because Brianna's been like on this, like, thing about getting a prank pulled on me. So I, it, that's what it could be. It's very well could be just a freaking prank. And if it is, all's good. If not, then we got problems. <sighs> I'm going to check the freaking surveillance because something's definitely going on around here. Now, why would somebody come in here and just freaking mess up all the furniture? You got to be freaking kidding me. I, I thought this was freaking, this was history. What's gonna freaking do with that? You gonna poke somebody? Yeah, you're probably saying, what is going on? What's with all these freaking clown videos? I thought that was over with. Why do you keep posting these stupid things? I'm sick and tired of it. Some of you were saying, yeah, give me some more. Give me some more clown stuff. I want some more. But you guys know what's going on, right? I, I just want to let you know in case you forgot about it or you don't know. Maybe you haven't watched any videos. But uh, it's not anything new going on. Don't worry about it. There's no clown things going on right now. This is stuff that's from the archives. Some never seen before archives. Some of the stuff that was posted then disappeared off of YouTube because YouTube police got a handle. You know, they, they saw it. Hey, this is a clown video. It's no good. You can't, you can't post that. It's not family friendly. We're, we're going to, we're going to make sure that video doesn't uh, surface. It doesn't get shown. It's uh, not going to get promoted. It's not going to get suggested. It's going to be there, but you never, no one's going to find it. And that's what they've been doing. So, you know, they, they have a way of demoting the videos, making them worthless, and all of, all that work goes into it, and it's like nobody sees it anymore. It's like it disappears. It's like deleted. So that's what's been going on. So I've been trying to help Rihanna, like, put it back together and, and get it out there so that they don't keep doing this because it was one of those things back then. About nine months ago, YouTube's uh, 
automated system was like in hyperdrive. It was like getting all the clown videos and it was like going crazy. And uh, I noticed they fine tuned it a little bit so it's not as uh, as crazy as it was before. So when you post something now, it's it, it's less likely for that to happen as opposed to like nine months ago. But it, whatever happened nine months ago, they can't undo it. It's done. It's like it's it's damaged. The, the videos are gone. It's like there's no way to fix that problem. So you got to re-upload them. But I, I, I still go through them and look for any possible triggers and I remove them. And uh, some of them I just don't want certain individuals in the video. So then I delete them out anyway because like, you know, I don't want them on YouTube. So that's the way it is. And I was like, hey, Brianna, you can put it on the channel if you want, which I think sometimes she's like getting tired of it herself. But Brianna just told me something the other day and I am just surprised and she told me that the friggin scary clown trend is coming back and uh, what does that mean for you guys? What does that mean for anybody? It just means basically that people are going to start going crazy again wearing these costumes and pulling pranks and sneaking up and I, you know all kinds of things that people were doing back when it started so it's basically that trend is coming back and uh, so you're going to probably see a lot of that stuff being shared on YouTube and uh you know, we might even be part of that. I don't know. But it's common for something like that, to, you know, for us to be involved with something like that and share with you guys because of the history behind it. But uh, you never know. It may happen and you'll see all this new stuff going on. And uh, whatever's happening, we're going to share with you guys. So just check around and find out. And just search on the internet. Google search things if you need to find out what's going on. Because I heard it from Brianna, so I'm sure she heard it from some other source online. So, you know... I'm gonna, I, I haven't had time to look into it because I'm so busy, you know what I mean? I'm doing work and everything, you know, not just, not just work, a lot of other things around the house as well. You know, especially with my new job that I'm doing work with and uh, it's a government job I'm talking about and uh, just doing other things and still uh, trying to uh, keep keep the house together because, you know, the storm came and it, it, it's like messy out there a little bit, but I've been doing a lot of yard work lately and uh, taking care of things like that and... Uh, Starting to get the eBay thing back together again, you know, my e-commerce and all that stuff. Trying to get that going again because, you know, I have to get that going. It's just, you know, I've been trying to trying to move along and uh, get rid of some things that I don't need because I just get clutter and I don't need a lot of things anymore. So why not put it on eBay? And I have a history with them. I've been selling for years and years and years like decades basically so I'm gonna do all that and uh right now I've just been busy with the new job it's just been taking a lot more time than I thought but hey you know what maybe it, it after 30 days I'll find out how that works maybe it'll be good maybe it'll be I don't know if not the other job that I that I have that I had to quit for a while which is in the technical field of uh, technical support for a company I can't say names of the company obviously for their disclosure but uh that's on hold until I figure out if this thing's going to work out after 30 days. If not, I'm back on tech support. And that's how that is, guys. And uh, my web designing work, I'm still doing web designing. As always, that's why I'm so busy. So, like, I'm web designing for these companies. And then, I don't know, this one construction company, I don't think it's working out. Uh, the people don't pay, I don't think. I'm not going to mention the name of these people, but some people just don't pay when they're supposed to. So, I'm not going to invest any more time into that. I'm going to go for other companies and just work with the ones I've been working with for over the many... Uh, I've, course of years i'm not even going to get into the details because like i said that's just business life and uh yeah miraculously i had time to grab a camera and i don't know if it's going to be on youtube or not i don't know if brianna's going to post it or not but uh yeah it's just been busy if i wasn't working i was doing yard work like i said there's a lot going on so uh anyway uh i don't know what's going on like with brianna and her youtube thing i know i know she's more into the musically right now she's more into that uh or now it's called tiktok and uh, i don't know she wants to do live streams on that tiktok platform and it seems like she's not showing much interest in doing live streams on the youtube platform i don't know what it is with that but uh she kind of lost that interest but maybe maybe because tiktok is more fun maybe i don't know maybe this because there's not enough engagement on here because I feel like this whole channel has died. It's basically dead, guys. I'm telling you, every day we're losing hundreds and hundreds of subscribers. That one video that was posted like a few days ago, it barely reached 10,000 views. I don't even think it did, and, and it, it didn't even get like but 600 likes. So I don't know where you guys are. I don't know what happened. I don't know if you disappeared, if you're not getting notifications. Uh, it'd be nice to know, uh, you know. 
you know, we do miss you. I do miss you, you know, commenting. You know, I miss that. Brianna misses that. I think that's one of the reasons why Brianna's kind of fed up with YouTube. I think I feel like she's starting to feel my vibes. I feel like my, you know, me being frustrated with the whole thing is rubbed off on her. And I feel like she's at the point where she could just like walk away from it and just like say, Dad, you know what? Just delete the videos. Do what you want. You know, I, she, doesn't, she has no, I feel like she's losing that uh, connection. So... That could be it, guys. That might be it. Uh, unless she rebrands the, the whole channel to another whole thing. We might make all these videos private. I might just, like, delete them all. Brianna will talk about it maybe in another video if she posts another video. I don't know. I, I just don't know if this is even going to make the cut or not. You know what I mean? It's just dad talking. Like, who wants to hear dad talking all the time? Forget about it. There's other people you want to hear. Probably like Shane Dawson or somebody else, you know. That's what's going on. I mentioned a few things about YouTube to Brianna, and, and she just kind of looked like she was frustrated. So I feel the frustration. She feels the frustration. Once Brianna loses interest, that's it. So we're going to have a discussion. I'm going to say, Brianna, do you really just, you know, want to just walk away, delete the videos, private them, what have you? She may just stick to Musical.ly or TikTok, whatever you call it, and just like totally just say goodbye to YouTube. Or she might just open up a whole new channel. And take it from there and this this one will be deleted. I'm not sure. I'm not sure exactly. This YouTube hobby has been it's been a fun hobby for the last uh, whatever since 2007. You know what? Ever since I started that I never let YouTube interfere with with my work and family time and education. It's like those things are always the priority and YouTube is just a fun hobby to do on the side and it's always been that way and I know some of you guys probably have the impression that's all we do is like make videos but if all I did was make videos I wouldn't have time for work I wouldn't have time for you know this education I wouldn't have time for the family time you know what I mean and then what would happen we'd uh, we'd be homeless because we wouldn't have a place to live if we, and we wouldn't have the internet wouldn't have none of that if 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 all I did was you know if what we did was YouTube, there's no motives behind YouTube other than just, just to share parts of our lives with you guys and entertain you guys and just engage and have that response from you and meet you guys because I love it and Brianna loves it. I kind of hold on to the hope that YouTube's going to get better and then, you know, you guys will start getting notifications then you'll start watching the videos and then Brianna will start getting excited again and then I'll be, you know, excited because I'll be kind of feeding off of her energy and then uh, it'll just be like an, a bigger, a fun thing because, uh, you know, this is one of the hobbies that we always like to, to do because it was something that we had in common, like ma making videos is something we have in common and it's a fun thing to share something you have in common. But there's other things that Brian and I can do that we have in common, like on the musical side and on the artistic side, it doesn't involve even the internet at all, just like exercising, that's something we like to do, like walking, getting our steps in. I like uh, to keep track of my steps, that's, uh, that's things I like to do. So there's more things in life than YouTube, but I kind of hang on to YouTube because I like to meet you guys places, and to me that's an icebreaker. When somebody recognizes me as an icebreaker, it's a way of engaging and, to and talking to somebody and making friends because, you know, it's so much easier when someone actually reaches out and says hi to me because I'm not very, I'm not a very, like, outgoing, I don't go out and say hi to people unless they say hi to me first, and that's the way it is, but I'll, I'll wave and I'll, I'll you know... But as far as starting conversation, unless they're doing something that I have a lot of interest in, then I'll I'll, uh, I'll engage in a conversation. But if they're just walking by, I kind of get socially awkward, you know what I mean? But I would like to be able to just talk to anybody and say hi, but then it just feels awkward for me. But when somebody like recognizes me and then they talk to me and say, hey, and then we get in a conversation, it's just, it's a nice breaker. It's an easy way to start, to, uh, you know, a conversation and make friends and and I have some friends, but I feel like, you know, some of them I just haven't seen in so, such a long time. It's like sometimes they fade away or, or they're only around when they want to borrow something or I got to go. I got to take care of business. You know, I got to take care of a lot more yard work before it gets dark. And uh, just got to put this camera down on the desk. Maybe Brianna will uh, add it in the vlog if she even does anything with one. I don't know. I mean, at this point, you know, could be the end. Could be the end of the YouTube posting. Or maybe not. Uh, we don't know. I don't know. I just don't see Brianna too enthused anymore. And I'm not enthused anymore. So if we're both not enthused, what's, what's going to happen? I don't know. That's the thing. Nobody knows. I got to go. Do you really smell this? I can smell it. Why I'm smelling nail polish and... Wait, you can really smell it? That's bad. Oh. Okay. Hey, how you doing? I'm doing good. How's your disease? 
Oh, you mean my, I don't even know, what, the flu, the whatever? Yeah, I, I'm better. Now I got allergies because now it's like summertime around here. It's been in the, se it's like 70s around here. Wow, that's, that's Yeah. <clears throat> so, oh, yeah, it's. it's a, Oh, hi. Oh, how do you know everybody's saying hi? Do you get like a notification? Comments. There's comments that's going. Oh. Oh, I, I think I see you in there on the phone. I'm here. Oh, there you are, right over there. She's right yeah. there. Yeah, I see her. I have to let these dry now. All right, guys, who's ready to come with me to go get some cold water? Cold water. And if you feel you're sinking. Oh, no, cold water. I feel like jumping in a pool. <gasps> three minutes left. Oh, my god! I know, three minutes left. It's the end of the world, guys. No, no, it's just, it's going to be the end of the memory on the, the camera. I can't pick up my phone. 